I'm Amy Brenneman, and I'm an actor and producer and activist. Uh, I grew up in central Connecticut, and uh, both of my parents are very progressive. Uh, my mother's a, a, a Superior Court judge, um, and she's who I based Judging Amy on, who's basically ripping her off right and left. <laughs> you know, I remember being very, very, very young, and, um, you know, my mother saying, take care of yourself, use birth control, know your body, um, and that and that abortion is, is, a, is a law of the land. That was a big win. I mean, just like, you know, uh, women getting the right to vote. I was 21. Uh, I was in college, I think it was like after my junior year. Or something. Uh, I'd been with a boyfriend for many years who was very loving and supportive and great. I mean, we used birth control and we did all the right things. And, um, and uh, I remember we were, I was in California visiting some friends in Northern California and I was going to meet him in uh, L.A. And I realized, like, oh, I'm not getting my period. I don't think I'm getting my period. And I said to John, I was like, I, I, think, I, I think I might be pregnant. And I guess I was wise enough to know, like, I'm not ready to be a mom. John paid for it and I was treated very well. And, and the idea of, like, oh, wow, I get to choose. Um, but it's a big deal to become a parent, and uh, it's a big deal to parent different kinds of children. Now that I am a mom, I have a 14-year-old and a 10-year-old, and I, I, because I live in a country where I could wait, I, I chose the right time, and even so, parenthood just knocks you on your ass. And I think what's amazing about today is like people telling stories, and some of them are sad, and some of them are not sad, and um, all of them celebrate uh, this basic law of the land, which is, you know, we, we get to choose when and how we have children. You know, I've actually never done this, which is sort of just say, you know, this is my story. Um, although now that I'm doing it, it doesn't, I feel like I should do it all the time, but it's like, this is what it looks like, you know, this is, this is it. If you start delving into your family and friends, you're gonna find a woman who's terminated a pregnancy, you know? So therefore, it's in everybody's life. Um, I look back at my 21-year-old self and I applaud her and I feel so blessed that I was in a place where I wasn't shamed and I was supported and um, it didn't scar me for life. <laughs>